Here in the Tri-State, thousands are spending the night on Fountain Square for its big New Year's Eve party. Local 12's Brad Underwood joins us from the party on the square. Well, Cindy, we've certainly seen a great crowd grow over the evening. Less than an hour now until the ball drops until midnight, but in and out of the bars and the restaurants and, of course, the ice skating rink, we've seen people out here having a good time despite the weather being a little cold and at times a little wet, but that's never stopped people from coming down to Fountain Square. As 2016 comes to a close, many choose to ring in the new year downtown. There's a little bit for everyone. The tree is still lit, the fountain in its many colors, and of course, some ice skating. It's something I like to do every year. I don't skate a lot, so I always have to relearn how to skate. Um, we both are relearning. Yeah, but I think it's just such a magical place in Cincinnati every winter to come down here and be near the fountain and the tree. For Laura Shapiro and her friend Billy Binion, it's been a busy few days. Binion is visiting from Virginia. Got in yesterday and she showed me the north side and OTR um, and today we went out to brunch and now are skating and we'll hopefully find some fun New Year's Eve you know, events to go to. The party began at 8 on the square but it's been busy all day and for this group it was just a stop to take some wedding photos. <laughs> for Sabina Jones and her children Madison and David Coming down to the square is always special. Well, there's always something going down at the square, especially that's family friendly. So, you know, New Year's Eve is about going out and having a champagne toast for most people. But, you know, when you have little ones, you kind of stay close to home. The kids may be content with watching the skating this year, but they do have a message for you. Happy New Year! Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. And you still have a little bit of time if you leave right now, if you're looking for a place to go to catch the ball drop. We have a full list of all the events happening online. Go to local12.com and click on the Get It Now links. It's under the new.